Back at 614, well, this is a story you will only see here on KHOU 11 News. A clinical trial underway here in Houston could be a game changer for people who are waiting on cornea transplants. Now, right now, one donor is needed for each transplant surgery. But as Stephanie Woodfield reports, new technology could one day allow one donor to help hundreds of patients. Five or six. Patients in Houston are some of the first in the country being offered a new kind of corneal transplant. Uh, eight, nine. The cornea is the clear outer layer at the front of your eye. If it's damaged or diseased, there's not a drop or there's not something that we can do without surgery to make that person see better. Dr. Zaina Almotaseb is running the local clinical trial. Roughly 50,000 people in the U.S. undergo corneal transplants every year. In the past, or even with DMEC surgery, you had one donor to replace that one cornea in the patient. But what's nice and exciting about this new technology is that you can actually have one donor can make, have the potential of more than 200 you know, different donor cells that you can utilize. This animation explains the cell therapy procedure. Instead of removing and replacing one or several layers of tissue in the eye, this option uses human donor cells. Doctors say it's less invasive and patients recover faster. With clinical trials still going on, doctors can't say how many patients have had this surgery or how successful those local cases have been. This technology is not FDA approved in the U.S. Um, what's nice is that there is data outside the U.S. of its safety and efficacy, and it's actually approved in Japan. Although it may be years before it's widely available here, if the technology works, she can already see the potential to help so many worldwide. Stephanie Whitfield, KHOU 11 News.